Rain comes as Harris County is $1.4 billion short in completing all of the flood control projects from a bond program voters approved after Harvey. We've been telling you about that. Now county leaders are looking for dollars in other places to get those projects done on schedule. Adam Bennett live along Braze Bayou tonight. Adam, why is there a shortage of money and what's the county doing about it? Well, Len, County Judge Lena Hidalgo says before she took office, the county got a verbal commitment of a billion dollars in federal funding, but they never got that in writing. And she says those dollars never came. She also says that construction costs from some of the projects were higher than expected. Braze Bayou is still being widened in Meyerland today, but last September it was already tested. Local leaders say homes that normally would have flooded stayed dry during Tropical Storm Beta. That project Braze did work. Today, Harris County Judge Lena Hidalgo said prior to her tenure, construction in wealthier parts of town, like Project Braze, got started first. These missing federal dollars were going to support projects in mostly lower income areas. The good news is that in those areas of town, they're not behind schedule. But she says the county needs to come up with more money before there are any delays. Harris County has already restructured its toll road debt, which not only increased our bond rating, so it was good financially, but it also helped us identify additional funding that we could use toward these flood control projects. Um, and we are meeting with the federal government, speaking with them directly, saying we need to make up that gap. Judge Hidalgo says they'll keep looking in the county coffers for more money, and they're also asking the state for help. We're working backwards. You know, when would it be that projects would begin being delayed because of lack of funding? OK, this is it. So we need to get the funding before that date. We don't want any delays. And the Flood Control District has until June 30th to come up with a plan B. And Judge Hidalgo is saying that she and all the commissioners are promising that every project that was promised will get done on schedule. Len? We certainly hope they're right because we're going to need it. Thank you, Adam. Yeah.